What up? Cheers, friends. It's time for Friday. Friday. Can't believe it's already here. What's up, Skog? Lilypad? Mia? King? Madame? Meteoric? Badger? Love to see you in here, Badger. What's up? Martius? Hello? Snazzy? Why so soon? Super Chip? Moki? Phoenix? Froggy? What's up? Hello, Doris. So good to have you all here tonight. Seven, good to see ya. Bringing the boys in here in a bit for a little back for blood action. We're back for back for blood. And I think next week would be that we're back for back for back for blood. It's just, it's never ending. George, good evening. Tristan, good evening. I have a video in the Discord for anybody who wants to know how to change your name for YouTube. Did you get a haircut? I got them all cut on Tuesday morning, Chico. Good to see you. I did. Took about a, I think it took about an inch and a half off. It was getting, it was like down to like about here. Needed to get trimmed up. How's it going, friends? Back for blood and also that coat we forgot in the club last week. Yes, exactly. I seriously have to be awake in six hours. I really need to sleep for tomorrow, but I was still up and wanted to say hello. Oh, also, not sure if you saw, the butcher just donated some casings. I did see that. I'm excited for you, madame. I'll get an announcement out about it. For anybody who's interested, Hot Dog Headmistress is Madame Rainbow Pants on Twitch. She's doing a 24-hour stream starting at 6 a.m. I'll post an announcement about it in the Discord for a good cause. I had two orders of nachos earlier and finishing the night with some ice cream. Guess you can say it was a good day. Nice. Stats midterm on Monday? Gross. Decent day. Was kind of sleepy at work all day. I had, uh, I had a good day today, albeit a busy one. I swear to God, I'm shedding like crazy. I have to make wieners. Yes, you do. If you want to watch Madame make wieners. Can't quite beat that incentive. But I had a good day. It was a busy day. But it was a good day. I had seven appointments back to back. And now I'm excited to sit here. And shoot zombies and chill with y'all. Let's see. Oh, Joe's already in chat. I may have joined a Discord full of people who think people fake their mental illnesses, but I'm leaving a lot about I'm learning a lot about how they think. You're right, everyone has a reason for their actions. They do indeed. Pretty rough day today. It was hard on myself, but I decided to end the day with some mindfulness crafts, and that's been helping. Nice. Did Joe get his 24-hour notice? Uh, no. Well, I asked him last week. Well, I, why don't I bring him in here, and he can tell you how he feels about it. Joe? His mic's muted, and I don't know that he knows that I'm in here, but he'll hear me when he sits down. Today was pretty chill, except for thinking I lost my mom's dog running around the house like a madman looking for a chihuahua. He was on his bed. So it's weird that you say that, Phoenix, because we actually got some pretty awful news today in uh, our family, which is that so my sister has two dogs. She has two German short hair pointers, and the older of the two actually jumped the fence today and disappeared. They are currently still looking for her. I don't know if anybody here is in the Houston area, Houston Montgomery area, but if you are and you see a German short haired pointer walking around, might be my sister's. She is like ridiculously distraught because the dog has never done anything like that before. So she's really stressed out. It's my, my brother-in-law and my dad canvassed the whole area for like six hours. They haven't found her. 
they're kind of doing everything anybody knows how to do to get a dog back. So, pretty rough. Such a helpless feeling. Yeah, I need to I need to find a picture to post. Uh, I need to probably post one to Reddit too, because usually Reddit's good at stuff like that. Twitter's pretty good at stuff like that. It is. Um, so is Reddit. So. Anyway, I mean, fingers crossed for her. I don't know. I mean, dogs are usually pretty good at coming back. She may just have got out and started walking around and got lost, but German short hair pointers are hunting dogs, so I got to believe that she's got a good sense of direction in her to come back. It's not like some tiny dog it's, that's, you know, at risk of getting hit by a coyote or something. Yeah, it's it's rough. She's going to... It's... Eh, man, I mean, it's like losing a kid, man. You just, and to like not know where she is. But it's all good. We'll uh, we'll hopefully find her. I'll keep you all posted on it. But that was the that was the big news today for us. They do put the blanket out there is out on the porch trick. The dog can smell it. Yep. Yeah. They uh, the, if you put like an article of clothing as well or something like that as well. The last place they saw her was I think was when they jumped the fence when she jumped the fence. I didn't call my sister today because when shit like this happens, people tend to just go freaking ham on like telling you everything that you should do. And I didn't want to, I didn't want to overburden her. So I sent her a text, but. I took my assessment for my job application today and it was super hard. I don't know if I'll get the job or not. I felt like I didn't know how to do anything. What kind of, I mean, what, how was the assessment? Like what, what is it? What was included within it, Mia? What's up, General? Uh, my sister's dog jumped the fence and then disappeared. They've been looking for her all day today. It's a German short hair pointer in the Montgomery, Texas area. Not fun. Hmm. But yeah, if you're just rolling in here, tell me how your day was. I don't mean to bring down the mood with the dog story, but. We're going to have Joe tonight. Jared's going to be with us as well. Sean will, I don't think Joe's, or I don't think Sean's going to make it tonight, but we'll have the three of us in a bot for some back for blood. We'll mess around and have a good old time. Oh, I can't believe it's Friday, man. These weeks are flying like I keep thinking every Friday I get to Friday and I can't believe that it's Friday like the weekends just go stupid just fast human invention. I know it's what's up anything it's not anything it just is it just is oh god Joe coming in here with the existential knowledge is it knowledge we could call it that, I guess. Ex existential bullshit, I think. <laughs> that good old EB. How are you tonight? Yes. Oh, you know. You? Oh, you know. <laughs> oh, good. Yep, glad we cleared that up. Yeah. My, uh, my sister's dog ran away. I don't know if you heard that. I did hear that. Yeah. It's very sad. It's, it's not great. I wonder if it's... Especially since it's the first time, I wonder if it's uh, having trouble adapting to home life. I'm not sure. I think, uh, I also think that there's a chance that her dog might go to her old house because they just moved like a mm. month or two ago. And uh, I really hope they contact the people that bought their old house to be like, hey, if a German short hair pointer shows up at your doorstep, that's ours. Yep, that would be a thing. It would. So what do we want to put the over-under at and how long it takes Jared to get here? Four. Okay. So will Jared get here before 9.54? Or will he get uh, here no. before 1.54? Oh, 4 a.m. Okay. <laughs> Jared, let's, let's see. I don't know what, what I meant. Will Jared get four ten. 
And this is 1030 wherever you are, chat, not where I am. You know, honestly, <laughs> uh, Miller, it might be four days. <laughs> Sounds like a pretty Jared thing to do. Yeah, right? <laughs> that was my best friend who I haven't seen in a year and a half. It was so needed. That's lovely. Um, happy birthday, Chico. Big cheers to that. Oh, next Friday is your birthday, not today. All right, well, happy birthday in a week. Take it back. Quick. Yeah, I take that back. Not a happy birthday today. No happy time. birthday in a week. Five second rule. Been a hot minute since I've checked in with you. Work has been really good, but also incredibly challenging. I'm getting more and more work put on me that makes things so overwhelming. Jag's been so great. It's helping me talk it all out and helping me create a spreadsheet to keep track of everything. Been in the office a few times. It's been so cool. Loving it every, more every time. Love to hear that, Badger. I'm sure that, uh, you know, when you get a lot of new information thrown your way, it absolutely can be overwhelming. So I hope that as you get, continue to get acclimated, the stress of that goes down. It's so lovely to have you in here tonight. Is the dog chipped? She is probably not. Um, which is, it would be very helpful if she was. I don't think they ever thought she was going to do that, but. Do you have a chip in Dave? Yep. Smart. He came pre-installed with one. Mm. That Pretty... would be super uncharacteristic for him to do that. Though. Yeah, sure. <laughs> That dog doesn't like being further than 20 feet away from any human. <laughs> Dave's the best. Dave is pretty awesome. He is laying on his back in the hallway right now, airing his crotch out. Nice. Sleeping. I have to do that Get sometimes, up. too, when I'm done golfing. At my house. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I just laid out in your hallway. Yeah, I remember that. Yeah. One, comb through a document using control F using words to answer questions. Section two, multiple choice questions about information given in the question. Section three, essay response on document given. Ugh. For a job? Yeah. Man, no wonder so many people are unemployed. Yeah, right. I don't want to hey, do any of those things. Me either. <laughs> hey, what kind of advice would you give to someone going through a tough time? I get those periods where I feel overwhelmed by sadness and separate myself from everyone. George, there is no one piece of advice that makes other doctors hate me that I can give you for that. Um, there are so many different things that can help a person through a tough time, and it depends on how it manifests itself. I mean, I would make the argument that separating yourself from everybody is a choice, and if that choice is something that's making it worse, that's something worth reconsidering. But different coping strategies work for different people. The thing that I always recommend no matter what is validation of one's own experience it's okay to have a rough time it's okay to not feel as great as you would like to but then focus on the decisions that you're going to make in terms of like what you're going to do to cope with it what you need to focus on if there's certain work you need to get done if there are certain people you want to be around that kind of thing but i don't know specifically what would work for you because different people have different things that help pull them through but acknowledging that you're going through a tough time is a really good place to start so I thought you were asking me when you read that question. I well, I mean, you're welcome to answer it too. Uncle Joe can give us some advice too if you want to I give was somebody gonna, some I advice. I was going to give a tip. Go don't for it. To, don't forget to breathe. Get air all the way down to the bottom of your lungs, all the way to the back of your lungs. Mm. It would shock you when you start thinking about that like once or twice a day, how often you don't do that. It's true. And it always helps. Get that parasympathetic nervous system engaged. Yeah. <laughs> Warriors are second place in the Western Conference right now. Sweet. Excited for the gaming with the boys. Me too, AJ. Jared's on his way down right now. So, who's uh, who's in Alaska right now where it's... No, Alaska's wrong. Who's in Mountain Time? No, that doesn't work either. What am I trying to say? <laughs> I don't know what, what I'm trying you, to say. What are you I don't know. Doing? Just what time zone are you in chat? I don't I don't know what I'm trying to say, man. Just time's hard. It's just it's a thing, right? Yeah, Essentially a think tank. It? Yeah. Well, I guess we established about ten be. minutes ago that it's not a yeah. Yep. It's for essentially a think tank that looks at pay packages for top industry CEOs. The pay is seventeen dollars an hour full time. I'm excited to see if I can get it, but it seems like a lot of work. Do they pay you seventeen dollars an hour to determine if people should make millions of dollars capitalism 
You should get a cut of that. You should negotiate a like a 0.5% cut of whatever that salary you find for them is. Who's in Arizona? I don't know. Not me. Time is a social construct. Somebody. If there's at least a person in Arizona I mean, right I'm now. I'm positive. I would <laughs> guess it's upwards of two or greater. If a person's in Arizona, but people aren't around to see them. Are they really? Are they really in Arizona? <laughs> ah, hmm. asking the real questions tonight. Do I exist or is the guy on screen the real me? That's a good question. How many eggs go in a really good banana bread recipe? I don't know. Don't know. But don't know. That's an important question. It is, especially if you're trying to make banana bread yeah, and make good banana if bread. You aren't. Yeah, <laughs> still, it's worth knowing for sure. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> welcome to Philosophizing Fridays with the fellas, everybody. Fufus, <laughs> fufus, <laughs> fufus. Hi, I'm new around here. Gonna lurk while I play a game, but I was wondering, do you have any advice for depersonalizing something? I find at times it's hard to take, hard not to take things personally. Well, you have to ask yourself what the function of personalizing something is. It's, I think it's important to understand that like one of the reasons people personalize things is because it, using inductive reasoning is one of the easiest ways to make sense of a thing because you just are using your own point of reference. To depersonalize means to look at context. So I generally encourage if a person finds themselves personalizing things too often, ask questions or pay more attention to the context around what a person is doing. There's a really good chance that 98% of the time it has nothing to do with you. And the parts that do have something to do with you should be communicated to you. But like if a person say snaps at you after you say something to them, there's a chance that that has nothing to do with what you said to them, that instead they're having a bad day. So broadening our expectations of what it is that's contributing to the thing that we're personalizing can sometimes help with that depersonalization. But also remember that personalization is a choice. It's a cognitive choice of how you make sense of something. So focusing elsewhere and creating that alternative context and alternative narrative means that, that like it's basically creating another possibility cognitively. A lot of people go to personalization as the de facto explanation for what's going on, and that's rarely true. The egg. Are we possibly all just reincarnations of the same thing? Yes, until we become a deity. I too have read that story. I really like that story. I do too. It's great. Phoenix, it's hello. Fantastic. I hope that's how the world works. Me too, man. Wouldn't that be Probably neat? Probably not, but that'd be neat. Yeah. Because you think about all, you know, how short life is and how many things you do get to experience. And if that was the way that it was, you'd be able to experience all of them. Literally all of the things of the things and yeah, well we are them would suck <laughs> but also you'd have good ones yeah. <laughs> every time i think about that story i just think about like you know let's say that that's how gods came to be and like that that's truly how a god is created like can you imagine how smart and empathetic somebody would be having the summed experiences of every creature that's ever lived that's the kind of God I'd want to be, man. That's That'd be great. That's what I say to people all the time about why I like being a therapist, because I get to learn about stuff that I would never get to learn otherwise. Because it it's makes you feel like God. Got it. Yes, because I have a God complex. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> I have a dog complex. <laughs> I also have sex daily. Do you? Okay. How much banana is needed to constitute it as banana bread? Back to the real questions. That's a great question. Because <laughs> at some point in time, like, does it immediately turn into banana bread as soon as there's, like, one molecule of banana in the bread? That's a, right. It's a great oh, question. Man. Like, if you had a piece of banana on your cutting board that rubbed off on something else you were cutting and that made it into the bread, yeah. is it banana bread? It certainly wouldn't make the entire bread taste like banana, but there is some <laughs> banana in it. So yeah. then the question becomes... You know, does that still constitute as banana bread? Or if it doesn't, is there a, some tipping point at which it would turn into banana bread? How many molecules of banana do you need? Yeah. Because hitting half a banana skog doesn't take into account the different sizes of banana. Yeah, or the but, amount of bread that you're making. Exactly. What elevation you're making the bread at. That probably matters. 
Yep. If I have every, if I have a piece of every ingredient it takes to make banana bread on my hand, am I banana bread? Yes. <laughs> as long as you have the right number of eggs. <laughs> I always keep at least two in my pocket. Well, that's, for trying yeah. times. That's different. Think about how many billions of cells we have in our bodies and how many microorganisms we support. Yes, a lot. We host many. So there was this banana bread joke that we're circling around right now. And w at what point does banana bread become banana bread? I know I just recommended uh, a Vsauce video the last time that I was on stream. You but did. There was another really good Vsauce video uh, talking about this exact complex. Uh, and the video was called do chairs exist oh dude and i love that i already love where this is going yeah it's 38 minutes long it's a it's it's a big one uh <laughs> i think the how many holes a human head does a human have video is a better video but i still think the do chairs exist video is very interesting and it talks about this exact thing like if there is a chair sitting in front of you and you scrape a minuscule amount of molecules off the chair with a knife is that it's still a chair and you would argue that yes it is is it still the same chair well yes but now not all of the molecules are still there so what did find that it was a chair in the first place and blah blah yep. blah that's we, i remember sitting in several doctoral level seminars talking about the nature of social construction and the the chair is always brought up because also do we define a thing by its function or by the sum of its parts or by its mm -hmm. materials like, is a chair a chair if it's used as a table? I mean, the ship yeah. of Theseus is always really amazing, too. Yep. Yeah, like, like yep. ship of Theseus is, like, mind-blowing stuff. I love Talks it. Talks about that in that video. Because our human body is kind of like a ship of Theseus. Yep. Yet somehow there's something that transcends that time that we're in this vessel. What's up, Teve? Teve! Teversons in the chat. You love to see it. Teve? Answer that fucking poll. Oh, what's <laughs> up, buddy? All right, chat, you were wrong. Unless unless you're in mountain time, in which case you were correct. How's it going, buddy? Hey, Jared, how many how many bananas do you need? How much banana has to be in bread for it to be called banana bread? How much banana has to be in bread for it to be called banana bread? Yep. yep. I mean, technically, I would say at least one banana. <laughs> What's a measure of one banana? Because what if I, I have what? What if I have one really tiny banana? What, what if you put <laughs> no banana in the banana bread, but you just called it banana bread? <laughs> I mean, then it's not banana bread. But well, what about my tiny banana? banana? My dog's name is Dave. <laughs> my dog isn't a Dave, but its name is Dave. So what if I, I mean, named it banana bread? Dave is not exclusively a human name, so therefore, just because your dog is named Dave doesn't mean it's not a dog or it is a human. It's just it's a no. It's I a said name. I said my dog isn't a Dave. Like what is a Dave? How do you define the name a name we made up? The thing that's called Dave. But isn't we banana a technically name. a name? Exactly. So if we made up the name banana and we made up the name bread, <laughs> checkmate. If I call this okay. banana bread, is this banana bread because I say it's banana bread, or do we define it by its physical properties? Goodness and in which gracious. case. All right. You know that the word name can have different meanings, as in a name for an object or name as an identifier. Well, for name's a construct Man, in and of itself. All you're doing right now is just proving our point. This is what we've been talking about, Jared, while we've been waiting for you. I'm going to name my dog Banana Bread. There you go, King. Do it, please. Oh, that's an amazing dog name. My next dog was going to be named Mark, but I think Banana Bread might be a better name. <laughs> Dude, his name's Mark, but we call him Banana Bread for reasons. Yeah. Oh, man. Oh, man. Uh, 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 hold on. Oh, Give me a second. man. King, please, if you ever do that, please tell me. I need to know. What if a tiny banana but a huge loaf of bread? Yeah, yeah, like what if it's a loaf of bread the size of my couch, but the banana is the size of my finger? If there is a if there is one whole banana in it, it is banana bread. No matter the size of the banana. Yes. Or the size of the bread. Yes. 
So if you put one banana in it, but the bread is the size of a swimming pool, Las Vegas, <laughs> it's, it's banana bread. The get, the get a world record for the largest loaf of banana bread only has one banana in it. But, but, yeah, but, but Joe, wait, but Joe, how many eggs would it take to make banana bread that's the size of Las Vegas? See, this is. A <laughs> question that nobody's talking about anymore <laughs> dude we, we had wanted to find it as the bread has to be like 50 percent banana then well but that's we the don't know. that's the <laughs> point that's why we're asking question. yeah this is good this is why we're here because we're trying to figure this out <laughs> <laughs> does the molecular proportion of banana to yeast and all the other stuff have to be 50 percent to be called banana bread because that's a finite quantitative measure Right? Like you pull out your old electron microscope and you count them all out. What if the bread is smaller than the banana? Is it then bread banana? <laughs> what if there was one whole banana and one microgram of any other ingredients? Is it still banana bread? Well, that's the, I mean, yeah, this is where we, do we define a thing as the second word based on the it being the thing the other thing is nested in? Did I, did I tell you, Joe, this conversation is reminding me of the conversation we had on stream a long time ago about how many oranges would it take to power the Luxor spotlight? And we actually calculated that on stream. Hmm. Because yeah, it, was it was my stream. It was your stream. Oh, that's right. It was your stream that we did that. Yes, it was great. You were like playing WoW or something, and we started talking about that. Dude, I was you know, playing The Sims. You were playing The playing Sims when we were talking about that? Yeah, I was playing The Sims and you See, came yeah, in my this chat. This is why we don't let Ryan tell stories normally. <laughs> is it? So wait, is it whose whose stream is it when I show up? It's still my stream. Yeah, that's that's an easy answer. Okay, question. good. That's that's well. I just wanted to lob a couple good ones at chat so that the hard ones are a little more palatable. Well, it's always good when the. Ooh, here's a good one. What about a golden banana or a metal banana shape? Is it still a banana? Yeah. And is it banana bread if you put a metal banana shaped thing in a piece of bread? Or if you just what if the loaf like a banana? That's what I say. What if the bread is shaped like a banana? Is that banana bread? I really like where this is going tonight. Mm -hmm. This is quality. I mean, all I can think about now is that I need to figure out how to convince my wife to make me banana bread while she's seven months pregnant. <clears throat> does being pregnant affect one's ability to make banana bread? It does because it puts her <laughs> further away from the ingredients. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> By an amount of distance that she's not used to, and that distance is increasing. Oh my god. Continuously. By the way, oh chat, can we get a big cheers for Joe? He's going to be a dad. Yeah. Big cheers oh, yeah, for Joe. I, I some congratulations to you about that, yeah, Joe. Congratulations. Thank you. We're exciting. All excited. We're all excited for Dave Jr. I'm excited for you to name him Banana Bread. No, he's going to be Dave Jr. Dave Jr.? There's, nice. there's no way you're going to call him Dave Jr. because your That's, dog was there first. That's what we've been calling him for the last four months. <laughs> him. Gosh. <laughs> <laughs> Little Dave Jr. Yeah. Joe is correct, by the way. I know from experience. I believe it. <laughs> Steve, do you have Back for Blood? Does Steve have Game Pass? That's the real question. Yeah, I say, if you have Game Pass, Steve, you can get back for blood. Dave, nicknamed Banana Bread, yes. Well, no, the next Mark is going to be nicknamed Banana Bread. Based on this conversation, are we sure Joe is ready to be a dad? Just come on. <laughs> I think that so. Is un that is unbelievable. And Joe is asking the kind of questions you would hope your dad would ask. I have, I have problems because my dad never asked those questions. Yep. Why I'm having to work it out right now. Yeah, for example, you're driving. That's one of your problems. Yeah, dude. I can't drive because my dad never asked me philosophical questions about banana bread. Yeah. Joe, thank you for that validation that he is a terrible driver. <laughs> That's all I talk about when I come on stream. <laughs> he's so bad. And he'll try to act like he's not a bad driver. I'm a great driver, chat. Don't you're listen to them. Terrible driver. Nope. You're just not used to my level of driving. 
You've been in the you've been like in the minor leagues with driving, and then you get in my car, and it's like you're in the major leagues, and you just can't handle the speed. It's like going from the NCAA football to college or to uh, pro football. You can't handle the speed. Yep. Hey, speaking of none of the things we were just talking about, did you see the goal Connor McDavid scored tonight? No. Because holy, swear is it crazy? Oh my god, goal of the year. Joe, you can curse here. It's okay. Fuck. <laughs> what go. if, what if the banana isn't mixed evenly with everything? It's only one part of it. Is the whole thing considered banana bread? Well, I think based on our conversation about a tiny banana in a loaf the size of Las Vegas, yes. Here's a better question for you, fucking weirdos. Uh, did you call it cursing or did you call it swearing when you grew up? Swearing. I think I just called them fuck words. Call them bad words. <laughs> Oh no, I said a fuck word, mommy. Oh no, are you kidding me? <laughs> what? Yeah, it's embarrassing. I figured How do you do it on stream? No, I can't, but like what? I I believe they were they had been out there for a while and couldn't get off and they were all just gassed. And he just comes back through. Oh! <laughs> Unbelievable. He's so good, dude. With three minutes left to tie the game. I think the Knights should make a run at him. Yeah, I think that would work. <laughs> Doc, we heard of the Vegas story of your Marine brother. I think we know how you drive. That had nothing to do with my driving. I was just the driver when that happened. Is it still mm. banana bread if you mm. cut the one part out that has the tiny chunk of banana? This is, I mean, it's exactly the question, isn't it? Yeah, this is where, this is why we talk about these things here. Hey, Dave. Oh, man. D, good to see you. Those of you that are rolling in, thank you so much for being here tonight. Thanks for indulging us in the philosophy. It's Philosophizing Friday with the fellas. Yeah, if you want to see the sports thing, go follow me on Twitter. There you go. I'm going to do that. But I did. I'll, I'll put it on my Twitter. So if you can find my Twitter. Just search Connor McDavid D Pants' Rangers goalie, and you'll get it. Yeah. It's on it's the NHL's Twitter as well. At NHL. It's an easy one. It's going to be the goal of the year, so you'll see it on Sports Center or, you know, Great British Baking Show or SpongeBob SquarePants. What, like, yeah, it'll be for on sure. Everything. And uh, you're. Uh, PBS station brought to you by viewers like you. Yeah. Is it technically yeah. banana bread if you stab a bread with banana? <laughs> <laughs> is it only banana bread from the time that banana yeah. Yeah. Added, or does that yeah. make it retroactive? It's the penetration that makes it bread, banana bread. Yep. Was the bread always banana? Yep. Yep. Psyched okay. to see the game eventually. We, I will get there eventually, Chad. I'm going to fire it up right now, actually. Because we can have these philosophizing <laughs> conversations while we play this. That's right. Tonight, it's time for a banana for bread. Yeah, or bread for banana, depending on the proportions. Oh, baby. Let's fire this up. I think Dave heard us talking about him. He came in to say hi. Oh, Dave. Oh, man. Oh, that's not ready yet. Next time you come visit, we're going to have to recreate the the shaken Davy syndrome video. Yeah. Oh, God. <laughs> you should. Uh, I'm that gonna, video I'm is so great. I'm going to find that real quick and show everybody. Um, yeah. So you can show everybody. I'm going to fire it up as soon as I watch it the cool. other day. Oh, I'm going to find it. If you no constantly. If you constantly talk to a dog till it reacts to the word banana bread, would it think it's banana bread? I think so. <laughs> Call it BB for sure. <laughs> Five bucks says LV scores a goal better than that by the end of the year. Five bucks? Yeah. Five bucks? How are we def oh, but wait a minute, before we do that, how are we defining better? Oh, how do we define money? Let's crumble our entire No, 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 no. Yeah, Shut up. How, how do we define like, better? Really question. Like how do you how is it better? 
Like, is it going to be better because I I logged on to click zombie heads and forget about the world? Not this. <laughs> I'm not shit asking that a we're philosophical right now. question. I'm asking right. you to quantify something so that I can spend five bucks on it. <laughs> <laughs> too much to ask. Well, we'll take a vote <laughs> on how do we Who define do? how do we define better? No, we'll we'll get a we'll get a quantified group of people together where there will absolutely be a majority win and we'll say which goal do you think is better and whichever how about this wins. if Connor mcdavid's goal wins goal of the year from the nhl you pay me five bucks and if an alex ovechkin goal that that's is a good way to do it that happens in the future achieves that feat then i will pay you five dollars but then if no one does it then no one wins any money yeah which is fine Wait, how about if none? How about if neither of those two do it? Then you each give me five dollars. Fuck off! We're not giving you anything. You don't need any money from us. <laughs> that was worth a try. If we anything, we're gonna pay Sean. All right. If none of them get, if neither of them get it, then how about all three of us give Sean five dollars? Uh, and he, we'll but we can't, but we shouldn't tell him why. We're just gonna give him five dollars, and he has to yeah. figure out why. He'll, he'll never figure it out. <laughs> he'll never. <laughs> he'll never. He's literally gonna watch this vod. <laughs> I don't know. Right, well, there's, that... there's that video for you. Oh, yay. Okay, hold on. Chat, I'm going to pull this up. I, has everybody sufficiently seen the banana bread on my screen? Oh, Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> all right, good. All right, let me pull this up. Let me download this real quick. I'm going to show you all one of our cherished videos of me with, of, with Joe's firstborn. Yep. The big brother. Dave Sr. You'll you'll love it, I promise. Yeah, it is great. Um, let's add a media source. Yeah, browse. There it is. Okay, Go. here we go. Oh God, hold on, hold on. It needs to turn. Need to need to flip that. Transform. Rotate ninety degrees clockwise. This is uh. This is me with Dave. Go. <laughs> <laughs> What's he doing? Probably so loud. Wait. <laughs> Wait for him to just throw up all over your face. <laughs> Dude, I can't believe it's weird to see him that little. Yep. Go. Look at him. <laughs> Yeah, isn't your dog huge? What's he doing? He is like yeah. yeah. If I tried to do that with him now, I would probably die. Wait for him to just throw up yeah, all over your face. Uh, <laughs> the other night, he Katie got up to go to the bathroom, and he got in bed and laid right where she was sleeping, and she needed me to move him so he wouldn't kick her in the face, and I where could barely sleeping. pick him up. Like I was mentioning last week on stream about how I had the the post workout soreness and. <laughs> it's not fun. Oh, man. Alrighty. Why can't I join you? It was so easy last time. I don't know. It says you're not in game. Well, I'm definitely in game. We got oh, a lot well, to the do Xbox app knows where you are. Time. Yeah. Hey, chat. Thanks for being here tonight. Appreciate you spending time with me and the fellas. Hey, there's Jared. And it's it's Jared this time. I almost joined Joe since he was having trouble finding you, but I can join Jared Joe. able to join you? I always clicked on his name and joined, joined so did, party. You, did you block me, Joe? Oh, I can hang on. No, I can join Jared. There you go. That's so weird. All right, we turning up the difficulty tonight, fellas? Without, Without Sean? Sean? No. No. Oh. All right. Hey, you. Let's go. Ooh. All right. So is this going to pick up where we left off? Yeah, it will. Um, we can just kind of like choose to go where we want. It might not, since it's the 
three of us, but I think it will because it's whatever it's whatever the party leader uh, left off, I believe, is. All right, I'm pretty sure I was party lead last week, so we should be. Hey. I'm using a pistol. I'm using a shotgun. Let's go ahead and uh, start this, Mr. Party Hello. Leader. You suck. How do I start this? Uh, hit, uh, I think it's tab. Yeah, it is. Hit tab and then go to your run. Okay. Um, campaign. Continue run. I want to let me continue the run. Select an in-progress run. Continue the sound of thunder? Yeah. Why is this not working? What the hell? This isn't working. Watch out. Are you you're definitely the party leader, right? Yeah. If I go to I go campaign and then it says Oh, is there one that says barroom blitz? No, this one's act sound of thunder, it's grayed out. Uh we might be starting a new run. Ugh. Ugh. You were a leader last night, why wouldn't it work? I don't know. Is it because Sean's not with us? I don't know. So if I say create run, select or create run, mission difficulty. I mean, can I pick us up where we were last time? Maybe. Oh yeah, I think I can because I can start us on Act Two, which is where we are. Oh, yeah. there you go. Okay. Okay. Good. Are we gonna get a random or are we gonna get a bot? Uh, depends on what your privacy is set to. I have no idea. Well, it said searching, so I have yep. a guess. Um, uh, uh, yeah, it's a searching for players, so we're probably gonna get a random. All right, well, whatever. Do we want to be really nice or do we want to be mean about him? What do you mean? I hope nice. All right, here we go. Oh, we have everybody unlocked now? Yeah, that cutscene we watch is when you unlock the new characters. Oh, shit. Well, I want to be Hoffman. You can count on me. I don't know what he does, but... Why don't you look at his card? No. I just like how he looks. We'll figure it out. How do I figure it out? <clears throat> What? Well, here we what go. Are you guys? Walker. Oh shit! Hold on, I can hear this guy. That oh god, guy is very loud. Left stick, mute all. There yeah, we go. Mute it all. There we go. Perfection. Uh. Second chance. Each extra life increases the number of times you can be incapacitated without dying. Hmm. Wounded animal. Critical health begins when players below twenty percent. Reload drill. All right, whatever. We're, I'm going to be this guy. I like this guy. He looks friendly. You don't have any new cars or you never made a new deck. So just click and go. All right. I thought you said that guy, that one guy sucks. I'm not him. I don't know really anybody. I'm here. Can you hear me? Mm-hmm. I don't know that I need... I don't die very often, so... I don't know that I need that perk yet. All right, here we go. All I have is a pistol and a shotgun. No, the dude quit, so we have a bot. stem the tide, but I've got a feeling the worst cool. is yet to come. We need to take this opportunity to press our advantage. 
That means we need to rearm and resupply. It's time to break out the cash at the arm. An M4? I'll take the M4. There are no civilians. Oh, Joe is going full send right now. There's nothing out here. I'm not going to allow hope to share the same fate. All right. This isn't where we picked up all that, so. Is this the first? This is like the first mission of Act Two. Yeah. Yeah, this is where we, where we were. Wait, no, I thought we already did this mission. We did this mission at night. I thought. Yeah, well, that, I... that comes later than this. I'm confused because when I picked this, it said Act Two. Or maybe it is Act Two. They're, yeah, I haven't I haven't beaten the game yet, so maybe we do come back here. We'll find out. Reloading. You guys are leaving all this copper behind. Use a scope. Should we name our robot friend? We can. What do we want to name the robot friend, chat? Charlie? Yeah. Person already has a name? Yeah, but. Lights on. What could we call her? Holly? Her name? Never know when I might need this. I guess. Yeah, there's a couple of stuns on a crate over there if you guys want them. Where? Back here, down this hole. Oh shit! Uh, actually, I have an ammo. I'm gonna hold on to the ammo. Name her Banana Bread for short, BB. This way. I mean, I'm down for that. I've got this. Also, oh, we got a big guy. Are we uh, are we good on audio levels, chat? I missed my vector. Basically. Yeah, I missed the gun I had in the last. We were okay, like all yeah, decked this is, out. This is different because this uh, gate wasn't open last time. Uh, what the hell is all this shit? I'm all right, sir. Accidents happen. Oh, uh, you should have a toolkit so you can open that door. Hoppin usually starts off with one. I have one. I say I do not have one. Really? Yeah. Is this a door here? Ammo. Yeah. Jared's kind of loud. Got to turn him down to zero. Savage King. Whoa! What is that thing? The spitter. Oh. It's the thing that always gets you. He stuck. was like, he, oh, he was like highlighted weird. Oh! Shit. Yeah, you usually want to back up from those things. I was trying, but I was on a staircase with him. That did not go well. All right, we got. Why is Holly following me? Go away. Got a Glock. Uh oh, so that's a mechanic now. What? Hmm. Uh, the car alarms are actually in the level. Oh, okay. Oh, there's a uh, card thing down here, guys, at the bottom oh, okay. of the screen. I'm coming as soon as I take care of this horde. Ooh. God, I love the M4. Oh, shit. Went up another alarm. Say? Well, I was trying not to, but... Oh, fuck. We got an arm guy. Oh, my God. Dude, die. Holy shit. How is the arm guy still alive? There's two of them. Oh, shit. Holy crap, man. We got a crate over here. 
Bandage. Pain There's mage. a spitter somewhere. Day, I can hear it. So just Made be careful. It. Patching myself up. <sighs> Watch my back while I patch, patch this up. up. All right. Where's that card thing that you found, Joe? Oh shit. The very bottom of the, bottom stairs, of the stairs where we came in. Where the hell are these? These zombies are just like crawling out of the concrete. Yep. Mm -hmm. hmm, this is a node level. I'm trying to figure out. Oh, we gotta follow those like yellow lines. Nothing to worry about. <sighs> Um, are one of you going to take that SMG? No. Yeah. Good guy. Dead. We have to get ready to room four. Uh, I don't think so. I think we can walk out over here. Yeah. We might not have to take care of these nodes yet. I thought we did. No, just get to the safe room. Okay. Then yeah, never mind. Yeah. All right. We're good. Oh yeah, Chad, I need to put it on the pole. Who do you think is going to die first? Oh, behind us. Bot, bot Holly. Yeah, I'd vote for the bot too. I'm going to put it on the pole. Vote, chat. Get your votes in. Go. Bot don't count. Oh, shit. Great job. I have a... Uh... There's a lot of gold in here, though, so I think it'll be mm. worth it. Yeah. See, it was worth it. Got some ammo. Right. Get out of here. Magnum. Yes, Ooh. give me that. Did not mean to do that. Come on, this, way. this Magnum feels like I'm shooting a hand cannon. Still in one piece? I got an arm guy on me. Oh shit, I'm with Holly. That was a bad idea to be with Holly. Loser. Arm guy's down. I think there was a spitter on me as well, but I don't remember where it went. Yeah, I just got hit by a spitter. I think he's. I think that might have been the same one. I killed it. I'm coming. All the way back there. Which way? Oh, we got... I think. Man, 67% of the vote on me. 27% of the vote on Jared. Or 27% of the vote on Joe, and then 6% of the, the vote on Jared. Too. Yeah. Wonder what's the People believe in you, Jared. Oh jeez, Joe was very far behind. Oh shit, yeah, we're yeah, we're fine. We're shooting Bot Holly. Taking this. Uh. Oh, maybe we're not fine. No, we're fine. Ooh, is this better than the one I have? I don't think I went the right way. I don't like that. Can I take? Can I not take the components off of a gun that's sitting there? No, once the components are on a gun, they're on a gun unless you uh, pay to put new ones on. That sucks. But, okay. You good, Joe? Yeah, yeah. Where the hell are we supposed to go? I'm actually not sure. Is Joe's way up top? I have never done this mission. Our bot is an idiot. Oh my god. Oh yeah, bot's bad. 
Uh, this doesn't look like... This is where we came from, over here. So you guys have got to be going the right way. Not going great. Yeah, Sean... Oh, I should have put Sean on the pole. It's true. Lights on. I think Sean, Sean technically died by not showing up today. That's true. Shit. We love you, Sean. Hope your diarrhea gets well soon. Oh, yeah. I'm, I'm near the safe room. Oh, God damn it, Jared. Big guy in front. Damn low. I'm actually very low on health. This might take me out. Uh, did you just run away from the big guy, Ryan? No, I'm trying to take out the other horde of zombies that's coming oh, from behind. You're trying, to, you're trying to have me die first. Nope. I put shots in him. Wow. Chat can verify. Nope. Nope. I Chat see, can uh, verify. I, see that now, I put. Nope. I put shots in him, dude. Incredible. Incredible I put shots play. in him. I don't want well, you to I'm die first. Bitch. I don't want you to die. I want you alive. That was incredible. I'm going to remember that for sure. Chat, tell Jared that you saw me put shots in the big guy. You know what you saw. Don't let Jared manipulate all of us like that. You're the banana of my bread, Jared. I just hope you know that. This is no time for horseplay. Get to the safe room. Guess who's alive? All of us. Y'all saw that, right? Jealousy is a stinky cologne. But, but Holly, ridden, killed. Zero. Zero. Worthless. I wouldn't say worthless. Sit in between me and a big guy and didn't <laughs> look at him. That helped. Unlock the handyman starting point. Rate the match. I give it three stars because I'm with two of my buds. Third star for Sean. One star for each bud. <sighs> the handyman. Make sure to stock up before leaving the safe room! Exclamation point. Gain access to the armory and the police station. The hordes are increasingly aggressive here. Complete oh the level with all four cleaners alive. To earn an extra money and supply. SWAT armor was meant to protect against bullets, not devil worms. These ridden are going to be harder to take down. Nah, nothing but little bitches. I ain't worried about it. I ain't ready. I'm worried about it. All right, chat. Pulse stays live. Rover 2, you need to find Bob Duresky. The armory has a biometric lock coded to his hand. Comms have been dark since the attack, and we all know what that usually means. Good luck out there. Coach out. Yeah, I need a scope. A scope would be fabulous. I don't like the iron sights on this. Oh, there was a first aid cabinet in here. Still no contact with Bob or oh, the others the I don't need oh, it. Oh, yeah, there's a zombie. Zombies. Five zombies are little bitches. We're fine. I got helmets on and everything. Nice pipe on. You check that, Joe? Yeah. I'm going to shoot every alarm in this bubble. Just so you know. I think cars can also blow up. Probably. Yeah, but like if you triggered an alarm and then just like blew up the car, I think it would actually take out the zombies. Well, the SWAT guys aren't too bad. There seems to be an inexhaustible supply of these monstrosities. Oops. <laughs> <laughs> Okie dokie. <laughs> Going here, no. Game so far is great, Bodega. How are you doing? Oh shit, I got way too aggressive. Way too aggressive. 
Alright, we're good. Here. Ammo here. Nice. Oh, hey guys, you know car alarm's gonna alert the horde? <laughs> Is that what was doing it? Oh, every time. God damn it. No chance of stopping he jumped out of the wall. Those on this mission. He was so well hidden. We had Tech 9. Ooh, that thing's uh, Check your mag. way better than what I'm packing. Uh, there's multiple alarm doors in here. I don't think we need to use What them. the hell is going on in here? Oh, dude. God damn it. You don't even look. It's hilarious. I really don't. <laughs> Oh, it's, this is a node mission. <laughs> this is not looking good. We're not gonna be able to oh, I just watch you bash through that door and then I jump through the well, open window. Like <laughs> I like to go in like a meathead. Two nodes done. Other ones all across. Could come in here. Watch my back while I patch this up. Bandage up. And then big node should be the one that's left. Oh wait, no, I think there's one more left. Probably below. Ammo here. Yep. Bob's gotta be around there here it is. Somewhere. Uh, there budge. are guns where we I'm at. MG and a shotgun. Some ammo over here too by me. There's also a crate. Is there SMG ammo? Uh, there is. Magazine here. No. That I see. Oh, there's a sniper in here. It's like an armory. Desert Eagle in here. Retire. Either of you have a toolkit? No, I know. <laughs> oh, no, because that case has some stuff in it. Can we destroy the? Oh, that's just a, that's just a mini gun. That's all. I don't need that. I really wish snipers were viable because I would love to use a sniper. Bob's leg. Why is there something called Bob's leg down here? Can you pick it up? No. It was glowing. It was highlighted yellow for me. Yeah. We have That's here. Weird. Oh, we have to find Bob's arm now. <laughs> Oh, yep, yep, yep. I remember what we're supposed to be doing. Oh, are you done this mission? No, it's, they told us earlier we have to find... I'm an idiot. And because there's a bio scanner to get into the thing. Ah. And so that's why the lag mattered. Jesus, man, this, this town had a robust SWAT team. They need a Destiny Scout Rifle. They do have a uh, DMR in the game. Oh, oh, I got got. Oh, oh, help. Little help. Little help. Little help. Moving. We're coming. Little help here. There it is. I got you. I love that the Tac-9 is a secondary. Can't get there. Destroy the nest to progress. The nest is that big thing in there, I imagine, right? Yeah, but there's smaller nests that we have to take out. Okay. How? Uh, literally just looked at the zombies while she gets hit. Yeah, she sucks, man. Something. Uh-oh. This might be the end. I got you, buddy. I'm in here with you. I wouldn't let you die. Uh, Alright, we can't do anything with this. There's a crate in here. 
with a Barret and a Vector. You want your Vector, Jared? That Vector is worse than my current Vector. Oh, I didn't realize you have one already. Okay. Damn, I need rifle ammo. Uh, Holly just dropped some in that room. Oh, yep. He sure did. Uh, I have to set this alarm off. Uh, Holly also just dropped more. Uh, yep. Oh, right okay. oh, he's puking. Holy shit. Oh, the big guy came up here. That's nice. He got puked on. All right, I took down the nest down here, so we can move on from here when we need to. Top, and then a frag are down here. Oh, you didn't need to open that door, did you? Yeah, of you course sure I did. did. You sure didn't. I want to make sure that we could exit either side if we got stuck in here. Mm hmm. You know how it is. Your lucky day, HR. Is there a big guy by you? Yeah, we got him. I got puked on, but we're good. Anybody need a cocktail or some wire or anything? Uh, if you have room for the wire, grab it, because something tells me if they put the wire in that box, we're going to need it. Yeah. I can take it, but I'm leaving a pipe bomb, which I like. Oh dang, that's the lethal and not the tactical. That's... Well, I'll take the I'll take the pipe bomb, J Joe, or I can take the razor wire. I have room for it. Well, come here, then. Coming. I'm coming. All right. Yeah, pretty decent sized horde coming right now. They ain't shit. Holly's like barely killed any zombies, but she's like covered in blood, so I thought she was a zombie. No yeah, I have the hardest bad. time telling the blood covered people apart from the zombies. I think that's probably by design. Yeah. Wait, why is it showing us a node in here? Was there one that we need to kill in here? Oh, there's like a bunch of big nodes um, that keep getting marked. And we have to ammo box them here, boys, if you need ammo. Well, what? It's already killed and it's still on my map or whatever. That's really dumb. Pretty low on health. Oh, I can get out of it. How do we get? Oh, I found it. We get up there by going this way. I have a toolkit, so I'm gonna open this door. God damn it! I didn't mean to shoot that door. Uh, health station here for when you uh, figure it out. All right. Oh! Holy shit, Ryan! You've killed me. Uh, also, a card thing in here. Oh, I got a sight. Yes. Oh, yes. Sweet relief. What about here? Where's uh, the uh where's the medical station? Oh, by me, right there. And there's a long barrel in here. There's a vector, but I don't want it. Um, I'm coming over. Yeah, I don't like the sight, so I'm not gonna take it. There's more and then I just that long girl. 
Uh, Joe, do you need uh, you need a heal off that too, right? Yeah, I sure do. I might take this last one as well, or are you lower than me? I can't tell. Uh, you can take you can take it. It's fine. Yeah, it's yours. Uh, we're gonna have to break this door open. So that's another alarm. All right. Oh, never mind. Nothing behind it. Sweet. Need to finish them off and so fast. far, so good, fellers. Grenade. I don't need that. All right. We're doing more shooting, Brian. What's up, buddy? All right. I'm about to awaken the big node in the middle. Just that should be more. all of them. All right. Let's go. Yeah, big nose up. This is Bob's head. <laughs> we need Bob's arm. We need his discount furniture. Hashtag right. not sponsored. I think we ran by the active node. Bold in here, but nothing else in here. Ready? Big boy. Oh. Got him for you, Joe. We're trying, brother. Another horde on the way. We've got company. Where is this last node? Quit moving around. I don't have to do this. Anymore. Good question, because I feel like we've gone everywhere there is to go here. Oh, that sucks. Ooh, there's a lot of people. Unless are we, do we need to work backwards? Uh, I just went back to our starting point. Nothing there. Oh yeah, here it is. It's over on this side. You got it? Yeah, I'm going to start knocking these small things out. Be it right, uh, there's but who yeah. and then uh, I just pulled the big. I have Bob's arm, but I can't shoot, I have to carry it. Well, we got your back, buddy. Oh, sweet, I can't still sprint. What's up, Night Elf? Mm, is there anything in here I want? No, okay, yes, can. Woo. It's up and to the right, kind of. Over here. No way to light it this way. Small. Hey. Nice work. The hell? Oh. What the fuck <laughs> happened here? Damn it. We needed these weapons. All right, so far so good. Damn, I can feel that beer I drank. Oh wow, you got a beer? Yeah. It was good. It was tasty. Look at all that damage. Oh yeah. What's uh what's your ridden killed numbers at, fellas? Two fifty-nine. Two thirty-eight. I'm at two thirty, so I'm in last right now. Gotta get that number up. Meh. It's overrated.
this game ended act four is there more actness to the right that just doesn't fit on the screen looks like it ends i don't know the answer to that actually i haven't beaten it we're beating it tonight right mm, yeah totally no <laughs> i'll be lucky if i make it through act two oh carbine Bang. There a chest here? Yeah. Uh, team supply slot. How did this happen? I didn't feel a quake. Rover 2, this is Hope 1. What is your sit rep? Over. Whether it was the Ridden or shoddy workmanship, I'm afraid the armory and its contents have been destroyed. I have God one pipe damn it, bomb. We needed those weapons. Continue to clean out the area while I come up with an alternative. I bought the support we slot. We can't afford to let them get a Wait, foothold. I'm gonna buy the offensive. Within our perimeter again. Hope one out. Oh, I need a red dot sight so bad. I need a stock for my SMG. Buy it. There we go. There we go. Oh, I dropped a fast mag. If anybody wants it. Nah. Look how these zombies are just chilling down here. Oh, wait, hold on. There's a big guy down there. Yeah? A little bitch. Oh. Yeah, no. Propane. Oh, wait. Let him run to it. Oh, okay. We're going to throw him all time. We got him. We hit him. He's still up. There you go. Oh, it's Holly who was just hanging out there. Holy shit behind us. Holy yep. shit. Yep. Big guy behind. Oh. oh, I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Thank you. Spitter guy. Oh, there's also a big guy who's going to alert. Oh, my God. Yeah, this is a... Uh... This got bad. Should have saved that propane. Oh, that's Holly again. Well, lost a lot of my health there. Just gonna. Eh, it wasn't quick. even that hard. Oh, spitter. Or puker, I should say. Look how that arm guy's just hanging there. Oh, come on. I killed that guy. Alright, now I'm going left. I do. Love the lighting in this. A lot of zombies coming up from the bottom. Yep. Two. Mm. I'm wrapping around. <laughs> Overflow the horde. Wait, gate calls the horde. All right, so this door has the objective. Somebody still it. have that barbed wire. Yep. Uh, I feel like you want to put it behind us. Open. It's probably a good no. idea. You think right it's here. right here in the entrance? Or? Yeah. You want it down there? No, right, like right here. Hey, I would put right it in the here. entrance. I'll pull it when you guys are ready. I'm ready. Is this the, which side's the, oh, okay. All right, it's open. Zombies are running out. A lot of zombies running out. You got an arm guy coming? Nothing to worry about. Good shit. Uh, a lot of zombies hanging out down here. Uh, I think there's some spitters. So just be careful. Yeah, there is. Got one. A big guy dropped in behind us as well. I got puke on. Yeah, I got there's a puke guy in front. A puker of me. ahead, yep. Still the one behind us. Still, there's an, I think an arm guy out in the distance yeah, too. Yeah, arm guy right in front of me. Yep. Oh, uh, we just got a snitch alert. Got an arm guy's done, I think. Big guy's dead. 
I am very low on health, so if anybody finds I got you me, I got you covered. Big guy coming into the entrance. I think we I think this is a move mission. I think we need to move forward as much as possible. I think down here is a death trap. Oh jeez, big guy just dropped down from the ceiling. Oh man, I'm one hit away. I think yeah. you're right about us needing to run. Yeah. Come on. Oh, here we go. This is like going into Riven's stomach. Holy shit. Oh god, oh god! Oh, big guy uh, near me? Yep, here it is. There we go, got him. Another one on the left? Yep, got him, nice. Uh, crate doesn't have anything in it. Damn it. M16 and AK47. AK47 is decent for starting out. Yeah. The red weed. I'm with you, Joe. HG Wells, War of the Worlds. The red weed. An invasive species from another world. Nothing to reward our. Exploration, huh? Let me know if you see any meds. Nope. You hear that noise? Whoa. All right. That guy jumped at me and I killed him in the air. That was oh, there's a toolkit room over here. I I don't have one. Is that a toolkit I have? I don't either. I might have one. Uh, Molotov here. here. Got it. There's a spitter behind you guys. I'm gonna kill it. Oh, fuck yeah, painkillers. I need these so bad. I'm gonna take the Where's lower tunnel the, here. Uh, Where's the thing? Where's what thing? The toolbox. Toolkit room. Right here. Up, up these uh, ladders, yeah. Do you have a tool? Do you have a yeah. toolkit? Yep. Oh, please be bandages in there. There is. Please be a health station. Just don't tell anyone else oh, a pipe bomb here. Yeah, that's mine. This could come in handy. Oh, Ryan, you're going to come back and heal? Uh, is there, oh, there's a box up there? Yeah. All right, I'm coming. Yeah. Oh, I did a terrible thing. What did you do? I fell into the next room. I'm running away. Oh, the room I wanted to run into is just me in a health pack. That's cool. <laughs> so there's another health thing here. So we can Oh, sweet. Yeah, Ryan, you can get a full heal. I'm good. I got one. Oh, I mean, like, there's another. Oh, you got full heal. All right, I'm gonna take this then. I'm gonna take another one here. Oh yeah, hell yeah. Oh no man. No, 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 how he take that? All these gonna be useless. Watch out. Bot Holly. The one nice thing about her is that she sees the like big zombies and like the spitters uh, before we do. Oh, I'll random card box. Right here. Ooh. Come on. Just what I want. Health, I'll take it. Fortune. Oh man. Well, going back is not an option, so let's find out how to go. Mm, there's forward. nothing over here, so we can do the overflow gate. Got it. Ooh, what's this? You Another pay card for that. thing. 50% weapon swap speed and damage resistance. Seems moderately useful. I think it's minus five damage resistance. Yeah. Oh, there's a big, uh, big guy. Oh, somebody else. All right. Oh, uh, there's bandages I there. I got the stairs behind us. Got what? I got the stairs behind us. 
Oh, okay. Nope, not anymore. I don't pull it, splutter. Oh, Adam. yep, and it just knocked me over the edge. I am all the way at the bottom. Oh, get to the gate. This is a run mission. Oh. Get off there as soon as possible. It's coming. Hell yeah. Take care of this. Oh, worried for Joe. It's right ahead. Come on. Big guy coming behind us. Up oh, the ladder now. Oh, it is better, huh? Got them both. All right. Yeah. I'll just waste the ammo now. Is there we like near the exit or whatever? Yeah, we're right. We're it's literally right oh, here. I should stop killing these guys and yeah, yeah, yeah. yep. Rack up my store. Yep. Ryan. I knew we could. Yeah. Sorry, I was just watching watching my carnage, admiring my handiwork, as one does, you know. I remember the last nice, time. Nice, Holly. Handiwork. Yeah. Yeah. Dude, Ho Holly's really pulling her weight. Yep. Three hundred thirty-nine ridden killed. Racking it up. Over a hundred there. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven more to go. That is a lot of more to go. <laughs> That's a lot. I'm gonna make it. <laughs> yeah, I guess act four is the final act. Did you look Boss at mutation, jeez. Armored wretches, oh boy. It's gonna be great. It's gonna be fine. Don't be a little bitch. I'm gonna go ahead and take that uh, plus five health there. I'm gonna do the same. Plus five health. You guys need to mess with that. I took plus five health and minus five Jared health. I just took a plus 15 health card. Fix your decks. Hey, we're not far from I don't want to play this game. Wouldn't that have the weapons we need for health? Hollow's not my first choice, but I'll take it. I can't. Damn. Can I put a hollow on the SMG? No. Yeah, I did. The general tried. He sent a couple of expeditions out in the early days of the club. I mean, I like the sight that I have on my. Fortunately. Love the laser sight. So awesome. All right, let's go, boys. to the clock we're going to get you your weapons general break yeah the helicopter over you get there you got it oh yep yeah, there's the boss Woo! another ogre we shoot or do we run away yeah. i mean it's right in our path we have to knock it out oh god This thing is pushing. No shit. I'm getting behind oh, it. Oh man, it's chasing after me so much. Yep, I got behind it. Sweet, yeah. Keep trying to turn it. It's aggroed on me for some reason. It likes you. Oh yeah, I'm in a hard to reach spot unless it throws stuff at me. Oh, it can go up there. <laughs> oh no. We almost got him. Oh shit. Oh, yeah. is he running? What the hell is he doing? He might be running. Or no. Oh, he's he's going to a high spot. Oh! Throwing his shit at you. Wow, oh, I literally ran out of ammo shooting him. Nobody messes with my yeah, there you go. Jeez. Kind of sucks that he doesn't like drop anything. Right. Like, give me an exotic. Yeah. Give me my Vex Mythoclass. I would have loved to kill that guy with Whisper of the Worm back before he got there. 
Oh, that's oh, one right of over. those guys. My bad. That's all right. We're gonna I was like, oh, guy with a red thing. It's going to spit at me, and I shot it. Yep. Arm guy down below when we get there. Oh, where are they all going? That's it, right? Are they about to like, choke points and stuff? We can go home now. They are. And why did I pick this so it's one of Ryan's friends. Oh yeah, he killed it. I think oh, arm guy might be coming up here. I don't like the letter, but it definitely oh no, I have no idea where the arm guy went. You should go up front. I hear him, I think. Yeah. Oh, he's behind oh, us, yeah. up on top of the thing. Oh, oh okay. yep, you just spit on me. That was fun. I'm going up over my head. It's a shame that the water doesn't wash you off. It's unrealistic. Right. Two out of ten. Oh, birds. Uh, oh, Jerry. I grenaded the arm guy and it killed the bird. Ooh, I just hit 2,500 SMG kills. Don't you dare, you bastard. Big guy doesn't care about the pipe bomb. Oh, thank you. Why would we <laughs> throw that Molotov after we hit it with a pipe bomb? Well, honestly, it's the first thing she's done the whole game. That's true, yeah. Here's a long barrel and some ammo attachment. Oh, I got, I got spit on. Oh, geez. Need help. Yep. Working on it. Thank you, Holly. Oh man, I guess going on again. I have no idea where it's at. Me, me. Holly, shoot this freaking zombie. Are you kidding me? Oh geez. Ryan, I need your help. Alright, coming. Where is the thing that's pinning you actually? Oh, it's on the ground. Uh don't break me out. Oh jeez. I am so low. Oh what? Oh no. <laughs> oh oh no. You're alive still, you're good. If we had channel points going, chat would be looking for a big payday right now. You would alert the birds. Did I do that? Yes. Nope. I didn't even know there were birds over here. I was just shooting. Was I literally called the birds oh, out. Fuck. Well, I know you called them out, but... Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. It might be me. It might be me. Ah! <laughs> no! <laughs> no! 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 Get me up! Another horde? Yeah, right. Get me up! Get me up! Holly, get me up! Yeah, that's ridiculous. Holly's literally just like looking at you. Don't worry, she's got ammo though. Oh! We killed all the zombies in a three mile radius. Now. Yes. Holy Dude. shit, man. If anyone's got Watch spare bandages, you have medicine? medicine. Uh, like painkillers? Yeah, that's over that'll, here. That'll give me temporary HP, but that's fine. I'll take that. I'm coming. I actually have some bandages in my inventory as well that I could swap. If you so prefer? Congratulations, chat. You got it right. You can also just heal me. Much appreciated. Wow, that I need to use the healing efficiency card. All right, whatever. I'm gonna pop these. Damn it! I brought about my own demise by shooting those birds, didn't I? Yep. All right. We press on. Stick together, you could get eaten. Worse, abducted. How do we get? How do we get in there? Oh, big guy! Big guy! Big guy! Very close to me. Oh, nice. Oh, uh, there's a lot of boxes in here. Uh, come on, baby, give me help. Uh, ammo. Uh, uh, taser. Ammo important. pouch. You guys get in there. Sure. I'm gonna grab the firecrackers. Oh, uh, there's a stun gun. It'll get you out, Ryan. What? 
There's a stun gun in there. That's how you get out of the hole without one of us opening it for you. Uh oh. It's your lucky ammo day, pouch. Char. Wait, is that a... No, it's not a card box. Oh, there's a lot of dudes out here. Yes, there is. I ain't scared. Oh, big guy, arm guy in front of me. Yep. Spitter. Wait, spitter or snitch? Uh, snitch. There's like no health on this hole. My goodness. Nope. Did you hear that? Where the hell is that guy at? Big, big guy behind us. I have two. Oh, yep. He dropped down into the. Yeah, he's building. like in the thing. Yeah. He's not chasing anymore. It looks like, so we can keep going. I think I found the way through. What's that? Everyone's Woo. all in one piece. Oh, watch a lot of sight. Nice job getting it. Oh, arm guy on me. I don't have oh, line of sight. Oh, oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I have no idea where it came from. He's still up? No, he's down. Uh, there's a, is that a thing? Oh jeez! Oh jeez! Oh shit! Oh, there are zombies coming out of the ground. Heads up! I might be going down here. I'm trying to run. Hey Holly, turn around, idiot! There's a big guy on me, puker. Oh yeah, I'm going down here. Yep, yep, there it is. Oh, man down! I'm going down too, probably. Maybe. I don't know how you got over there, Jared. Oh no, is this the end? No. You just gotta get to one of those, Ryan. Don't worry, oh sweet. Holly picked me up. Oh. Glad she likes you. A copper over there? Oh, there's shotgun ammo on the back of this truck. I think we left one of the big guys somewhere. I yes. blew him up while you guys were down. You guys? I was up the whole time. Yeah, I don't know what he's talking about. I don't have to do this, you know. Jared, I deserve you, credit. Holly. Holly just healed me. Could have done that earlier. It would have been great. Good for Holly. She's worthless, dog. First aid cabinet somewhere? Yeah, it's somewhere. I don't know where. I just got the pop up for it. Yeah, me too. It's probably on a wall. Thanks, Ryan. It's not back here. See that? Reloading. Something on the up, up in front of us, maybe? Oh, I see it. Up there. Uh, Joe, the hop up over here. What the hell? How the hell did you guys get up there? Oh. Ammo here. I'm gonna take another one. Ryan's gonna get one, right? Yeah, I need one. Well, you take it and we'll see if I want another one. Yeah, you take it. it more. Such a sweetie pie. What's up, Kamsu? Everybody who's in chat, thanks for being here. Thanks for hanging out with me and the fellas tonight, as is the Friday tradition, starting last week. They're coming up straight from the water.
No spitter. Big guy is punishing my shit. A lot of copper in here. Oh. Nice. Uh, anything good up here? No. Don't need this. Stand over here. Wrong way. There we go. We gotta go over there, huh? Might set off an alarm. Good come in hand. Entering the building. Nope, there's nothing in here. Man, this is the worst loot run I think I've ever done. Things have been pretty sparse. We got an arm guy. You're on your own out there. No free hugs. Potential. Oh, you just okay. Just went in there. Yeah. Why not? You gotta you gotta give us a heads up in case it triggers an alarm. You would have known if it triggered an alarm when the alarm went off. Oh my gosh. You know? Interesting if true. <laughs> I mean, one can only... Uh, toolkit door. I have a toolkit. Oh, hell yeah, Joe. Hell yeah, brother. Nice. Ryan spitting wisdom. Use, but... That's right, Ika. Hey, there's like a whole bunch of money and also healing well, what in here. Do you know. Yeah, that's all. Hey, M4 carbine assault rifle, not as good as mine. Ooh, I'm taking this Glock. I'm opening this crate. Woo! Let's go. Little bandage, little grenade. Uh, egg beefed up AK. Not as good as my M4. Jeez, this auto Glock is nutty. This way. You're just like bop, bop, bop. A little bit faster than that. Like bop, 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 bop. Door. So. So you say. Big if true. Arm guy. Of course, there's literally nothing in it. That's great. Awesome. Oh, this fucking spinner. Arm guy. Oh, jeez. Alright, exploders down. Arm guy's still up. Dead. Another, ex another spitter or exploder, I mean. Big guy up top, dead. Alright, might trigger another one here. Oh, no. We're good. Oh shit, guys! Guys! Ooh. Let me guess, it was a thing on the wall again. Sure was. You would be correct. Patching myself up. Nothing to worry about. You think you'd start looking for those? I have been looking for them. I've shot a few of them, but I didn't. I didn't look for that one in particular. No, yeah, why not? You should have, because that one was there. Yeah, I know. I got. Uh, oh, okay, I was gonna say, Joe. I got. You don't have to waste your thing. Man, you all rocking right past like shitloads of copper, man. One node down. Big guy in the middle. Yep. Watch out, Charity's right behind you. Oh, I'm out of ammo. I'm fully out of ammo. I am not far off. I might have to pick up that AK. Oh, and I don't have my melee bash card. Fuck. All right. Holly was see. just like crouching down, and she had seven of them just slashing her. She wasn't doing anything. She just dropped ammo. I need that so bad. There we go. Oh my god. Yeah. Next time you see a uh, melee weapon, I need. I need that. Oh, spitter. Oh, spitter some more. Yeah. You got him. I got him. Oh, Holly. What's the matter, girl? A tough fight. 
But Turns out through. standing still doing nothing isn't a good strategy in the uh -huh. zombie apocalypse. Right, Cat Catatonia doesn't do it. That the armor horde guy horde crawled out of things. the ground. Yep. The big, big note is up. Boy. Oh no. Big nose down. Get the big guy. I'm shooting this. All right, big guy's dead. Oh my god, I'm so hurt. Big guy. I'm so hurt. Oh. Stay alive, Ryan. Oh my god. Oh, there's a uh, puker down. Oh, he actually melted him. Survive! Woo! Joe, what are you using? Gun wise? I don't like clutter, but Some it carbine thing. Okay. Seems fine. And my nuts are achy right now. There's still one charge left in that thing back here, Ryan, if you want to. Do we have to go that way anyway? No, that's the way we came from. Oh shit, dude. Guys, there's like four cases up here that we just walked right past. I don't know if we were walking right past them so much as, you know, fighting. Some zombies right past them. Oh, look at that Uzi. Thing is decked out. The primary, though. I don't know oh, that I want ammo. that. Requires a tool kit. Yeah, we don't need the minigun right now. That would have been helpful for that fight, but you know. Got ammo here. Um Yeah, I think is it back in that warehouse? Where's the health kit? Turn right safe. past Much the obliged. truck out there. No, other way. Go the way I'm looking. <laughs> oh, okay. Turn I'm right coming. here, go past uh, that. Right Extra ammo, I'm full again. It goes in the door over there. Oh, right. Beautiful. All right, that'll work. Still plenty of ammo in here, too, although I don't need any of it, so... All right. Cool. Where is the safe room? I actually don't know. Um... Is it up here? That's in know. here. That door doesn't How do you open. get in there. Gotta be crafty. Can maybe do some parkour. No. Up the truck. Oh yeah, you go, you go up and over the node. I uh, could do blow. that. Or, oh, it broke since I tried it last time. I get it. Oh, geez, spittered. Please don't. Oh, fuck. I'm out. Got it. There's an alarm door in here. Do we want to open it or no? Yeah, why not? We're right by the safe house. Hey, guess what? Room's completely empty. What a fucking surprise. Hey, right, I'm going in the safe room. Good idea. Good idea! Of course it's a good idea! Right. I love going in a safe room and seeing a bunch of dead zombies. Oh, man! The intensity. Let's see what we're up to now. Five fifty nine, damn. Six more to go. I might be able to do one more. <laughs> That's all right. Give me health. Yeah. All right, chat. Need good oh, okay. energy for Joe to hit his second wind. Where is the shot? Still garbage. Mm. All right. 
I'm ready. Big guy in front of me, arm. Oh, and a, and a uh, spitter's down, arm guy's up. Arm guy's down. Good. Ammo here. Keep up. No one have to go back. Another big guy. He's armored. Ooh, like a real big guy. Nice. Oh, sweet. That's going to take care of the minis. Got to dump into him. Oh, God. Oh! Wow. Fucking rock, Holly. He's got weak points on his legs, back, and chest. He's also got weak points if I shoot Holly instead of him. And there it goes. Don't ask me how it works, because I don't know. It sucks. Alright, there we go. Opening a box. Bandages. I'm going to grab one in case anybody else is to grab one. Uh, oh, sorry. I had shotgun ammo. Anybody want firecrackers? Uh, I'll take them if you don't want them. They are up here. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Bandages. Got bandages over here, fellas. How'd you get up there? I jumped across from this side. I don't know if that's what you're supposed to do. I mean, hey, it looks like it works. Yeah, Untether yeah, the boat. Right on this side, too. We need to get across. We got chests over here. Uh, Wait, where are they? Uh, oh, I see them. Never mind. Don't worry. Firecrackers. Thank you, Holly. Yo, what's up, Jareth? Good to see you, buddy. <laughs> I missed you that time. <laughs> oh, man. So that's what that noise is. There's a uh, melee weapon right uh, here, Jared. There I'm go. gonna drop Magazine. this auto Glock if somebody wants it. Right there, Brilliant. it's pretty nice. Handgun here. I gotta start recognizing that noise. Do you have to use the toolkit on that? On what? On that door. It was giving me the option. Or lowering that thing. No, lowering, you just need to do it. I'm untying the, I'm untying the boat. Are we getting on it? Oh! Got a big boy. I've got this. Hmm. Uh, we need to back, we need to loop back around through this door. Oh! You can't swim in this game. Yeah. Oh, I can take over Holly, that's cool. Armored guy. Oh, Holy I'm in the shit. water. There we go. Oh, no. I'm out. Let's put me in the water. There's a spitter right, up there, there we somewhere. Go. Uh, yep, right here. We got it. Oops. What? Hanging with my brothers in our PJs. How do we? Do you have a defibrillator? Uh, or am I just Holly from now on? That sounds. Yeah, weird. I was. I was gonna tell you. You might have wanted to wait for us to revive you because now you have to be Holly and your guns are gone. Unmasking monsters, solving mysteries. Except now the monsters are real. <sighs> and there's a lot more guns and killing. Wait, I don't want to be Bot Hoffman. You're not Bot Hoffman. You're Holly. You're Holly now. I can't. Yeah, you can't so switch, I don't. You can't switch back. Oh, that's dumb. Hmm. It switched me to her automatically. Yeah, this isn't spooky what? at all. You should have to hit a button to switch. Oh, there. I'm him again. I'm Yeah, I'm Hoffman. Oh, well, maybe they changed that. Yeah, I got my guns back. Watch That's out for nice. the birds, Jared. You mean those? Oh, 
Uh, behind us? Question mark? Yep. Yeah, behind us. Period. Another spitter. Oh, jeez. That spitter's so fucking up. These birds the guys will now war, Jared's famous last words. I mean, I'm still good. Holly save. Reloading. Yeah, I'm fine. See, look at that. Run up the score a little bit. How come the apocalypse has so much flooding in the streets? Good question. It's almost universal. Wait, why wouldn't it? Why would it? No one's there to maintain the infrastructure. I guess. Wouldn't that make it so that all the wood that falls down soaked up all the water and there'd be less water in the street? Do you think wood just naturally soaks up water all the time? Yeah. Yeah. Every time I put water on wood, it soaked it up. Somebody want to break me out? Or I'm got you. I got you. Wait, what kind of wood are you using that doesn't soak up water? Or at least live in not all it's wood is dirt. like water permeable. Like you're not just, it's not just well, I mean, it's not like not thing. stained wood, but it also can reach a point where it can't hold any more water. Ooh, Holly's getting her shit wrecked. Wow. Yep. Good for us, though. That's all she do. Yeah, I mean, if she's willing to tank this, I don't have any problem with that. Big guy out here behind us. He's going to puke on me. I don't know if I can. Hey, Jared, Micah says thank you for death loop. No problem, buddy. Micah. Glad you're enjoying it. Micah, we need you to get ba back for blood so you can join us. Big guy in the distance. Dead. Sniper rifle here. Ammo here. Lucky day, HR. Got oh her. shit. I got her. Okay. What's that? Uh, SMG ammo. We got an arm guy coming over. Stick together, you could get eaten. Oh, wait, no, sure, you're not using this. I'm gonna grab that. Reloading! Oh. We'll say the game could use a little bit of zombie diversity. Ammo here. Like I'm all for putting armor and shit on them, but like the new new zombie types would be really neat as you like progress through the story. Yeah, I was surprised there weren't more like special. I mean, zombies. those those shrieker things aren't in the first uh, part of the story, so you do get a little bit of diversity as you go along. There's also the bosses. Uh, there's birds over here. Don't shoot in that direction. are awesome. Reloading. For sure. Uh, I don't think you get the you know, people who drag you away in the first act either. Or at least not till like later in the, the first stalkers, act. The stalkers, you mean? Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, uh, toolbox door. I have a toolbox. I do not. Oh yeah, rocking the AK, baby. Somebody just wake up birds? Why is you're literally in this root house here in huge guy? I think I got him. There's one more out here. Oh, he just went behind the house, so I can't get him. Oh, there's another one in the distance. Oh wait, no, there's a horde timer, that's what it was. I didn't realize we had one of those right now. There's heal charges in this room I just opened. Holly is straight up shooting at the air. Along just with shotgun blast. Straight in the <laughs> sky. Much nice. better gun. Oh, baby. Killed a big guy without learning the birds. Let's go. There you go. That couldn't have ended soon enough. Uh, kinda... Joe, is there any health in there? Yep. I'm scavenging okay. this trailer park. 
Oh, sweet. It's actual health station. Fuck yeah. Oh, there's another uh, toolkit door here. Brian, do you need health? Uh, yes, I absolutely kit. do. It's over here, Joe. Do I still have a toolkit. Where's the health, Jared? Hey, where you are? It's on me. It's on me. All right, I'm coming. Oh! Oh! Almost got sleeper. There we go. There's health in here as well. Another, like, med station? Yep. Mm. I don't know that I'd spend $60 for it, Micah. I'd probably be... Oh, and there's a card in here. Car oh, sweet. Right, I'm coming to you, Joe. There's a, oh, there's a card in there? I missed that. Yep. Where are you? Oh, because you didn't open the door. Oh, right. I don't see the card box in here, Joe. Where am I? Oh, here it is, in the closet. Ooh, health. I'll take it. Did you guys leave any left over in that other one, or did you use it all up? Uh, I used, uh, there was I like used one it. one charge in the other. Oh, you used both of them? Okay. Let's see what's in here, shall we? Uh, this one still has three, though, Joe. Well, I'm going to take another one, then, just to top it off, since yeah, Holly's I'm, not going to do shit. <laughs> yeah. Top it off. What's up, Ellie? We do have a bot. Bot Holly. Bot Holly. Also uh, known as Banana Bread. She is kind of uh, getting backpacked. Ah, like a thief, um, travel to the mobile me. home park, search mobile homes stuff. for supplies option. All right, how do we get nice. to this fucking park? Probably by walking. Saved your life, Jared. Thank you. Did we go through, did we go in all the trailers? Sure. I think we actually did. I think that's the way we came from. Oh yeah, this is the way we came. All right, let's get out of here. Can you walk next to the birds? Mm, I would not recommend it. You should be able to. Like, just try crouching. There's a big boy up here. Come my way. Now you've got Holly with you, Jared, and I'll be over here. Oh, come on. That's bullshit. Holly, come on. Holly. <laughs> Holly. There we go. God, she's worthless. Oh, she yeah, dragged Ryan. me right into some birds. Ryan. Yep. Dude, she dragged me there. She didn't do shit. Well, maybe don't push your head by yourself, huh? Ain't my fault. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Fuck, you got, we brought so many. Oh, jeez. Dude. We got this. We got this. I've got you. Here. Now I won't Ooh, see? It wasn't so bad. Thank you. I'm up and ready to go. Game's not even hard. No sleepers in there. Bandage down what? there. None the worse for wear. Oh, we gotta get out here with Joe. There's a lot of zombies coming. Coming. Horde cover. Oh, there's also this uh, safe room, so we could just get in here. Big guy. Yeah. Soon the safe room. Two zombies. What a team. Woo! Holy crap. Does this game have anything like hard, like hard rain? That rainstorm kicking up in the middle of the horde was so fun. There was a level that was super foggy when we played this last time. But I haven't seen anything like that. I mean, yeah, there's like so many things they could do with this game that they didn't do. Like what? Like hard rain and shit like that. Environmental stuff. That is so many things. Environmental <laughs> stuff, diversity of zombies. Did uh, Left 4 Dead have hard rain? I don't remember. I didn't play a lot of Left 4 Dead. <sighs> How we doing, Joe? I'll do one more. All right, a hag is stalking you. Ooh.
All right, chat. This is the last one. We need all the good vibes you can muster. Left 4 Dead had a campaign named Hard Rain. The rain would pick up and blind you for like 30 seconds every so often. Yeah, see, I like that kind of stuff. Like, this is the kind of game that needs like a million modifiers for like longevity. We're also on the easiest difficulty. No, that's true. I mean, I understand that. Like, we don't even have it so that friendly fire is on. So, I don't know how thrilled you would be about that other stuff once we turn that on. Well, so here we go. So, like, this level right now is kind of like windy and rainy. We have our lights on, so that's good. I, the one that we did where it was like super dark where we were was awesome. The sewer one was pretty cool. Not yeah. Sliding down that pipe. I'm all right, sir. That was nice. I am definitely surprised there's not more special zombies, though. But the bosses are great. Are we just supposed to run through this part? Yep. Let's go. What the fuck is that? I don't know. I heard something weird, but I'm getting the fuck out of here. Yeah. If it's a hag, um, let him know, because those hag. things are tough. Oh. It must be the hag, anyways. Yeah, he's stalking us. I'm, I'm booking it. Big boy. Arm guy ahead of you, Jared. Oh, you're geez. right. Oh, need help up. Need help up. Here we go. Zombie on you. Wow, it takes a long time to pull your ass up. Yeah, it does. Look before you fire. Oh! Oh! You back in. Wow. That sucks. Where the hell do we go? Oh, this way. Okay. We running out of Oh no! Oh no! Hold on, I got you. Here, take my hand. You guys both ran by one of those Walt Jumpyote guys. Ag intro. Oh, the hags, the hags on me. Oh jeez. Oh, I see it. Oh! Can we even kill it? I think yeah, we can. can. It's just got a lot of health. Oh my god. Oh jeez, it is. The hyper and there's spitters. Oh, Hag's got me. Hag's eating me. He's got a thing on his back. Just pelt him. Oh my god, I'm getting puked on. Hag's digging. All right, Hag's gone. Jesus. A little self care here. Uh, boxes on me, crates. Oh, geez. What the? Oh, I'm back. Oh, sweet. Okay. Yeah, I got you. It is what it is. I was like in the middle of opening a box and I just got snapped back to the Where was the box? Oh, it's it's so far gone. Dude. Yeah, I don't uh, just push, yeah. Um where do Man, we go? This is intense. Oh, here I have a toolkit. So do I. The old river boat. I took my mother on that once. There's a hag in front of us again. Oh I fucking I do. Oh, uh, it's pushing on YouTube. Oh, you can't fit through the door. Yeah, I'm trying to get through it now. Ugh. Oh, I lied oh, again. It ate me. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. Oh, get me out of it. Is it like carrying you? Oh, my yeah, God. Yeah, get me out of it. Ah! It's your stomach so I get out. No. <laughs> it was pregnant with me. That was nuts. I... 
ripped that thing and it still took you. you got so much health, man. I kind of feel like it just like, oops, just like can't be killed maybe. It has a weak point. I think it just has a shitload it of health. Just, it might just be the weak point to let you out when you're in it. So. I poured three mags into that health point. Or weak point. Spitter right in front. Yeah, he's dead. Holly's tanking it. All right, there we go. You want to know why Holly's tanking it? Because I'm Holly, bitch. I was going to say because that's all she do. First time that works too. Sure this Come on, buddy. Oh, and I'm back. You know what Holly didn't do? Trigger alarm door. Who did that? Was it me? No, it was uh, Hoffman. Spitter behind, spitter behind, spitter behind. Both of these doors are alarmed here. Got it. What's that? Oh, Alright, we're good. Yeah, Ellie said she's killed the big guy before. They just have a lot of health. Uh, Auto Glock. Beretta. Ellie, I thought you said Ellie. I was like, yeah, I dude, Ellie, Ellie, well. Ellie plays this all the time. Card box. A card in here. Is this a spitter? Yeah, it's spitter. Okay, oh, safe house is right here. Holy crap. You'll get yourself killed out there. Greg, oh, did you guys get these Jay cards? Fred in earnest, yeah, we did. Yeah, we got them. And we, cool. and we said, hey, there's a card. Jared. That was a super quick level. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Are you all right? Knew we could do it. No. Woo! <clears throat> Good old wall stinkers. I got my shit rocked by that hag, man. Got me in its belly and then took me under. It's real scary. Unlock the broken bird starting point. Whatever yeah, that it's means. Just like a, it's just like our uh, save point, basically. Love to see it. This is the last one of this section. What do you say, Joe? Uh, yeah, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> Poor guy. This is good. We've 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 pressured Sean and Joe successfully in subsequent weeks. Yeah, but I liked it better when I was pressuring Sean. Yeah. All right, chat. This is a bad example of boundaries. Health box here. I use one charge. I just bought my health. Hell oh, yeah, dude. Fucking gold mag. Yeah, dude. Pretty sweet. Ammo box. Looks like All right. Feels good. Surface. Just need to find what we need. Armed guy already. Oh. But instead of a timer, they're things trying to kill us. Good one, Holly. Dude, Holly's hilarious. I love that she's here for the comic relief. Great. Over two, this is screaming eagle. We're inbound on your position. Man, that epic expended mag is amazing. What is, oh, big guy, arm guy behind you, Ryan. Oh, all right. The pipe bomb. Whoa! 
Oh, that was a really cool rag doll. Attaching hook. Uh... Mini gun here for later if somebody has a tool kit. There's a box on me offered by the cargo container. There's a toolkit box over here if we need a minigun. I don't have a toolkit though. Literally just said that. There's a toolkit tool box, over, box here. over here. If we need a minigun. I have a toolkit. Do we want it? No, not yet. Uh, we'll open it if the boss pops up. Here's a box. I don't know why it won't let me attach the things to it. Holy shit. I'm getting destroyed by an army. Busted. Dude. Uh, coming. Oh. Coming. Uh, I kill him. I'm coming, but not fast enough. There's a spitter up top. Do the pinky thing. Pinky thing? Oh, dude, pinky thing always works. <laughs> oh, <laughs> <laughs> I thought you said there was. Oh, man. I thought you were allergic. calling out a zombie. Nope. <laughs> I don't know what you're gonna pull out. I mean, okay, now. Uh, here we go. <laughs> oh, man. Oops, stalker guy on the on the plane wing. Stick together, you could get eaten. Got him. Always being dragged away. Nobody cares. Oh, we got a boss. We got a boss. Boss. This would be one of the miniguns. Good, Joe. If you want to try and grab it. Nothing to worry about. I'll try an aggro. Hey, we're gonna set it up. Uh, maybe in this big open space. Yeah, Jerry can kite him over, or we can kite him over. This would be a good spot. Oh, shit. Oh. Did oh you set God. it up yet? Oh, no. Arm guy's gonna kill me. Oh, my God. I'm, I'm falling. I'm falling. I need somebody to help me up. I'm coming. I'm coming, Jerry. Boss damage. Holly's kiting the boss. Oh, Holly's got you. Yeah, we'll see. She's, she has a bandage out. Holly, pick me up. <laughs> oh, God, Holly, you piece of shit. At least kill the zombie that's attacking me while I'm getting him up. Good God. Oh, my God. Oh, birds? Where are the birds? I think you said it burns. Oh. I think we need to get in this boat. I don't usually like There's a lot of stuff on this boat. But on this occasion, ah, who am I kidding? All right, going up in the air. Brian, on us. Yeah. What's on you? The exit. Oh. Oh, we have to go all the way back there? Jesus. That's where the final container was. Oh. Oh, there's a dip here. Hey! Good thing they've missed all that rebar. Holy crap. <laughs> Wouldn't, have been mad. Wouldn't have been great. Hey, we completed plan B. Ninety-nine. It's fifty-five. Forty-seven. 
got over 800. 801 ridden killed. How many did you guys get tonight? Only oh, 742. 721. Oh! Let's go. All right, we finished act two, except for the part that we didn't. Yeah, but it was it was fun with the friends we made along the way. Yeah. Look at all the cards on the next one. Jesus Christ. Yeah. All right, two more, Joe. Nope. <laughs> nope. Sean said I couldn't. Okay. That's fair. Yeah. That sounds like Sean. This game definitely seems prone to just one more itis. Yeah, it is. I mean, look, two weeks in a row, we got our friends to push past their boundaries. It was great. Well, hey, chat. I'm actually pretty tired, too, so this seems like a good place to end it. We're ending a little early tonight, but after a long day and lots of zombie killing with the fellas, I'm going to send you all off into the weekend. Be back with Red Dead tomorrow night. Before I go, thank you all for making the effort to come out tonight and hang out with us. Make sure you like the stream. Friday with the fellas is a weekly occurrence because there's a Friday every week. Not sure that we'll play Back for Blood every week, but we like to mix it up. Nice to have Joe and Jared along for the ride this evening. I appreciate you fellas hanging out. Screw Holly, though. Damn. Holly sucks. But y'all are the best. Thank you for coming out and spending some time with me. If you're watching the VOD, thank you for watching the VOD. Red Dead Redemption 2 Part 14 will be on tomorrow night. So in the meantime, you know, you got VODs you can watch. Jared, have you heard of the concept of Fridays? Skog wanted to know, but never. Uh, Jared's not listening, Skog. All right, friends. As I always say before I leave, I mean it for each and every one of you. Hope you say it to yourselves as I say it to you. You matter. Your experiences are valid. Don't let anybody ever tell you otherwise. Have a wonderful morning, afternoon, evening, or night, wherever you are. Catch you tomorrow, friends. Adios.